All right, before we uh, start this video, I just wanted to say thanks to uh, whatever your name was. One of the viewers that uh, is building a 390 himself, for I think his Galaxy or something, uh, noticed on our assembly video that the splash guards in the uh, head uh, were backwards. We had all kinds of issues that day that we were fighting through, so slipped past us. Sure as shit, they were both backwards. So we had to pull the valve covers and swap them uh, around. So if you watch those videos and you notice, then this is just kind of a disclaimer, hey, we fixed it. Didn't film it, just fixed it. If you have them backwards, I guess it can restrict the oil flow, starve the top, some stuff you don't want happening to a nice new engine that you're in the middle of rebuilding. So forget your name, but thanks a whole lot. And uh, problem fixed. So now on to some tedious engine accessory, external accessory prep and work. Well, it's rainy and miserable again, so I decided to go to the junkyard. Yay! A uh, couple of good junkyard finds, I guess. Got a couple coolers. Gonna use this transmission cooler as a uh, transmission cooler. Took it off of a school bus, you know, a short bus. Seemed appropriate to have a short bus part. Plus, they had the most heavy-duty transmission coolers. So, that will be our transmission cooler and got this smaller transmission cooler off of a super duty pickup truck, like a work work truck. I'm uh, probably going to use this as a power steering cooler. And dust cover for the transmission, which I'm missing. This was free. Bonus. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is get some brackets and exterior engine stuff ready to go onto the package. So I'm going to have to get that rusty crap cleaned up and painted. Get it ready to be bolted on. It's gross and grimy. So a lot of cleaning and painting. So here's the old water pump. I bought a new one, but uh, these brackets will be needed, so I need to get those cleaned up. The starter is pretty nasty. That new dust cover for the transmission, I need to get it painted as well. So just a bunch of stuff to clean up before I can go any further with exterior engine. With that added to my pile of stuff that needs cleaned up and painted. That dust cover is already done, so I'm going to put it in. Here's the progress with some pulleys and brackets nice and painted. This stuff's pretty grimy, so it's slow going. So this top pulley right here used to have the mechanical f or the uh, yeah the mechanical fan uh, bolted to it, so it had really long bolts that came out this far, but we're putting an electric fan on this build, so we had to go in and get shorter bolts with these uh, little locking things so that we could delete the fan, so. Okay, the, uh, what the fuck? <clears throat> Front of the engine looks better. Got most of the pulleys and brackets cleaned up, painted, and installed. Put the uh, dipstick and the transmission and the speedo cable and hook up the lines and then dump some transmission fluid in it. Slow going, but some progress. Looks better. Looks more like an engine. 